Hi guys, it's Splinterverse. We're playing Hex Shards of Fate. The format is Mary Melee Corinth. The game is free to play on PC and PS4. So check out the link in the video description to download the game and get started playing. And this is our 200th daily match. So thank you for joining us for over 200 days of Corinth. Hopefully many more will follow. I actually don't own this battle um, mat or whatever it's called. I wish I did, but you have to earn cosmic coins. I don't play a lot of standards, so I don't have enough cosmic coins to buy this. This is pretty cool. I think I'm going to take this. So yeah, I have never played on this bad board. That's what it's called. Love Curios. Got lucky with that because he is turn one player, so he's going to be ahead of us as it is. Hmm. Would like to have this and this. Let's go with this and then hope for the best. Life Drain would have been good too, but. It's a quick action, so we're going to play this on his turn. is really the best because it can be used to take out anything. We've certainly enjoyed our 200 daily matches with you guys, as well as our Frostering Fridays and all the other stuff we've been doing on the channel. So hopefully you will subscribe if you haven't already and click that bell icon. Show your friends. Keep on watching with us. And share in the comments anything you'd like to see, other games you'd like to see me play, or just any thoughts you have, questions about Hex. I really like this battle board. I wish I had it. <laughs> um, trying to go kind of wide with the thresholds because when I play my 7 drop, it's going to... Um, It's gonna blow away a lot of stuff in my deck. I wish I was taking the Dingle Dance, but what are you gonna do? I don't have a lot of troops yet, so I don't know what I'm thinking I'm gonna use this on, because this guy's pretty high for his attack value for his. Uh, cost, so if I up him, chances are he's going to just stay at, um, where is that? So he's using that for removal. This guy on the other hand though, he might be a good target. Alright, let's go to the green. Wild. 200 matches and I still can't call things by what they are. 
Um, okay, I'm gonna take this for later. I just want to use my metamorphosis. Oh, that's great. Even worse. That's okay. We'll play it again on it. <laughs> okay. Just gonna create a random action. We can kill that with this. Or this. But let's start with this. Oh, so I have a, oh yeah, that's too bad. Oh well, wall attack. Plus eight, plus eight. That's why I did that. Because I wanted to escalate. Since I couldn't kill it with the gorge of the gore god, because it got this silly socket down here. Which is stupid, because the cost would have been actually way higher. Wish I had eight resources, but I don't. So, yeah, this isn't the most exciting, but it will reduce the cost of this guy, or the attack value of this guy. Kind of needs to attack here to get the rage going on it.
I'm going to do a dirty little trick here. Take a lot of these. Probably because he wants to keep the lethal option here. But he has to sacrifice another troop for the lethal option, so I don't know that that's that great. I did that because if he wants to get lethal on us, he's going to have to sacrifice his main dude. So he has a choice block with it. I should have attacked with everything, honestly. But. We made him get rid of our biggest threat. This Kaleidotron did a lot of work for us. Well, it's too bad it has Portal, because that's a great card. I would love to keep it as that, but... It's going to turn into something else. All right. So that was our 200th match. Kaleidotron was the MVP as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> but let me know in the comments what you thought the MVP was. And anything else you want to share. Thanks again, guys, for joining us for 200 daily matches. Plus, because we had some bonus matches and some frostering stuff, as well as other games. So hopefully you'll stay tuned and stick with us. And until next time, happy hexing.